All right, we're here for round six. We're three and two. We lost the last round to Four Color Shadow. We got our, we got our butts kicked. It wasn't really that close, but hopefully this one works out better. We got a Five Land Eater. Uh, yeah, we're going to keep this. One, we're going to put this on the bottom. Oh, shit, I thought we were on the play. Spirit in twenty nineteen. I think we can we can top sixteen. I don't think we can top eight. What am I looking for? Recycle here. In a removal spell or a discard spell. And then I can still Thought Scour on my turn. And then play Gurmag. I'm kind of okay with if they counter this. If not, it's going to let us play Gurmag next turn. We already have one good discard. Nah, I'm just going to wait. See another card. See another two cards. All right, you got it. Phil plays Amulet. Yeah, Phil's not very good at Shadow, but he plays he plays a lot of Amulet. I kind of want to do this now, so that if my opponent wants to counter it, they can't deal damage to me. That might be a meme. I think I fetched the wrong land, too. I wasn't even really thinking. Yeah, so now we just play two threats. I'm going to do the bobble now. Because one, two, three, four, five, six. I probably want to leave a Thought Seize in my graveyard. Because that might nab something. No, I probably should leave the Thought Scour because I don't want to be tapping out in my main phase against the Spell Caller deck. Deputy of Detention. Well, goddamn. I guess that's what two threats are for. I'm going to figure out a way around this card. Nah, we don't test often because, like, Phil just beats me and I feel all sad inside. Amulet <laughs> thick. A Morsel Cleric on time. <clears throat> All right, well, let's loot here so that we can look to grow our shadow and have a good attack. Oh, that's nice. I kind of just want to ditch both of my Gurmag Anglers. I'm also not wild about attacking. The problem is, is if I attack, the self remorseful cleric is likely going to get into combat, and then I can like dismember, and then on my in some other turn like snap dismember the deputy. But I'm definitely I should have killed. Oh, I'm so stupid. I should have like engaged in combat before. So hopefully this. No, nah, it's done. I think regardless, I'm getting rid of at least one of these Gurmag anglers, if not both, and I think I'm getting rid of both of them. Here. Yeah, we're going to get rid of both of these. Now, what am I doing? Yeah, I think we're just getting rid of both of these. I could get rid of a bobble in one of these, but like now, because like, I think I, I think I messed up. It would have been nice to pop this thing off early. Yeah. Yeah. 
but is there any point? This bobble might matter with a fatal push though, so I probably shouldn't have played it. Playing a little too fast. Playing a little too fast and a little too loose. Give me the two fur as you free my soul. I want to get lost in your rock and roll and drift away. Um, I hit a push, so we want to crack this now. That's my emote. I have Cat's emo, but Cat does never stream anymore. So I don't get to put it in her chat. Oh, they. I had to dismember the Remorseful player. God damn it. It's alright. My opponent doesn't hit a land. We'll just Battle Rage and win. Damn it. Because they got to exile the player. I'm not playing very well. About four and a half hours into my stream, get a little tired. No, nah, we're just fast and loose all the time here. Idle on. Yo, that might get you killed. Um, six, twelve minus four is eight, plus five is thirteen. All right, so now we get the slight. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, this thought sees is nice. Take their deputy. Yeah, we're still just going to take the deputy and then attack, and they have to block next turn if they want to keep the captain around. Like, we might not get the spell caller them next turn. We're not going to get the battle rage them next turn, but we take the deputy, they play cat, they, and then we can, like, force a chump block. So, and if they time this, if they don't time this right, they could just die. Well, they can get it with Spellcaller. So we have to like we have to like make our opponent act. That might kill them as well. Like basically the way to play against spirits is just to be patient because if you try to jam too much, then you get like racked into their tempo game. I ain't about that life, Lawrence. I'm about getting them dead. All right. Okay. And I'm just going to kill this now. Before they can untap. You won? Way to go, Inferno. Well, no, no, because, like, well, Lawrence, when I saw their hand, it was Draw Spell Captain Spell Queller, and, like, you have to be patient there. You know, you can't, like, play into anything because then not only do they, like, they get a board presence, then we're good. We're three and two. 
We are three and two. We're struggling. All right. We have spirits. Let's go over to Mr. Michael. Mr. Michael Raps, sideboard guy. I wonder if spirits is even on there. Oh, it is. All right, we'll want the vice president cast down. We need some hope, some brutals, and a bolt. And we're good. This one's so much easier because it's a Google Doc. That's literally it. Uh, we're going to keep. All right, we're going to do this. So if I do this now, Gives them another turn. But I'm going to want to do this before their turn three because I can't beat a guy to St. Traft. I might as well wait until my next turn because I get another draw step and I get to look off this see what I want. Even though like it's pretty sure it's just Geist of St. Traft. But we're going to pass. Did I play the wrong land? Did I? Did I? Did I play the wrong land? <laughs> All right, let's get a watery grave. <laughs> oh, my. All right. So I want to Inquisition Gurmag this turn. So we might as well start off as I get a basic swamp out of this and like a steam vents here if I need to. So let's check out what they're doing. Oh, they have that on top. Could Thought Scout with them play Gurmag. Or I could just go Inquisition, Dismember, Snap Inquisition. Yeah, that's probably way better. <laughs> oh. Well, I think... We take this here, Supreme Phantom, and then we try to get him. It's like decent. I'm not going to. I guess I'm going to let my opponent hit me here with just a. Uh, I really want to get another card, but they're not going to do it in here. No, I didn't. I didn't even scour. What are the odds that if we take this, our opponent just like goes into it? Probably like slim to none. I probably should just play straight up. Especially considering I took so long. Like they have no plays. They're not going to just phantasm image this. We might be light on the red mana this game because there's a, definitely a chance that, like, I might have to snap back this dismember. I'm 
time. Yeah, I still think I just go snap island, snap discard spell path to exile. Because even if they get this deputy in play, I can kill the deputy before they can uh, image it to get something else. <clears throat> yeah, I still think I just take this path. We're on the battlefield. Being on the battlefield against spirits is nice. Just because, like, there, it's, it's, it feels like you've kind of gotten over the tempo hump. It's not that good, though, because, like, now we're going to play a Gurmag Angler into this Spell Queller. They're going to Deputy it, and then we can go Snap, um, and then we can go Snap, uh, Dismember it. So, like, their hand's, like, it's not that great. Like, we can kind of play around this. You think if I attack, you think my opponent will flash it in? And just eat my Snapcaster Mage? They probably will. I, I kind of just want to chump check my opponent for the memes. I can't wait until they snap pack us. Dude, chat, should we, should we like... If I play my Polluted Delta and I attack, do you think we'll get it for the memes? I don't think they block. I kind of want to do this. I just kind of want to run it for the memes. Play that. They fire up Mutavault deal. Yes! Yes! I don't even care anymore. I'm going to leave up. How much man? How much should I delve? How much should I delve? I might find something off of this off of this um, thought scour to play, so we don't have K command. So I'm just going to delve like this. <clears throat> Isn't the Muta... What does the Muta Vault do, Lawrence? It's a 2-2. Two -two. They can't pump it. Like, I don't think there's any way... Like, this is kind of a meme, but like... There's no way they actually block, right? Like, is it actually correct for them to block? I think that's a big negative. Oh, you're hoping? Okay, I, I, I missed you. I thought you were calling out the uh, the play. All right. Um, right, I'm not snap. No, we're not doing anything. Okay. I didn't think they were going to do the snap. How does that work with deputies? Does it take both of theirs? Does it get rid of both of theirs? Yeah, it does. I need to play faster.
events tapped. Only your opponents. Is that good? Now I just bolt snap bolt. What happens if I go bolt, snapcaster, bolt, crack for seven? Now I think I'm just gonna go bolt, bolt this angler, crack, and then kill the deputy. I could literally just play another Gurmag Angler and then get them with the Snap Bolt next turn. Because their hand is Deputy Image. Yeah, yeah, I'm just going to play another Angler, shock myself, play a Gurmag, and then just Snap Bolt them end of turn. Snap Bolt the, the Deputy end of turn and get them. <clears throat> No, but what I'm going to do is, like, play another angler. They're likely, because, like, I'm going to know their hand. So they're really likely to go deputy off of these two lands and, like, this. And then we can just bolt the deputy, and we can crash in for 12. So that is the plan here. I'm kind of projecting a little bit, but, like, I'm not really sure what my opponent can do about it. Oh, that's annoying. That was a good draw for our opponent. So now we got to untap. Oh, now we in trouble. Now we in trouble. What are they doing? Oh, they're targeting Gurmag? Oh, now they're making that play. Huh. They can copy snap and path my angler. Yes, they can. We're getting clowned. All right, untap. Now we could lose this game. Because they still have a deputy in their hand. So I guess I just attack, then snap bolt this. Because, like, if they play a spirit, attack with Gurmag, block, block, bolt. We take one, but we take three, block, block. Maybe I shouldn't, I shouldn't have projected it. I think that's what, like... Tipped him off here. I'm going to attack with the Angler. I can attack with the Snapcaster too. Because they can't go Deputy. And if they go Deputy Animate, we go Snap Bolt. That block. I guess I shouldn't attack with the Snapcaster Mage. This game got harder. Well, I'm not really sure that I want... Because if I go Thoughtseize, and I go Snap Bolt, and they draw a creature, then they draw a Spirit, then I just die. Though I probably can't even, can't take this hit. All right, well, now we got to bolt this. Do we have to bolt that? 
we vote that, yeah, we just die. So we have to vote. Pull the spell queller. Last card is deputy. All right. They don't even have to chump. We did. That game did not, I mean, it was probably because I was like clowning around, but that game did not feel very losable and then I still lost. And it was probably because I was like messing around, but I don't know. I don't think I shouldn't have lost that game and I did. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Four four dream lives on. Yep, we're just gonna submit. Should not have lost that game, and I did. Cause I feel like I shouldn't have. Oh, are we having technical difficulties? Maybe. No. No. What's going on? Oh no, our stream's gonna crash. I don't really know what to do with this bobble, so I'm just gonna fire it off to cycle. If I had a if I had a fetch land, that would be different, but I just don't. And I have to find I need to get um uh, I just need to fire it off. So I'm gonna check out what my opponent's top card is. It might help inform my my sleight of hand. Rattle chains. Both those are great. One of them's better. Take this last out. I hope she takes me to the promised land. I would have liked to get both of those. Both those cards would have been nice. All right, that's another good draw. Um, Looking for a discard spell. There we go. All right, rest in peace. You got it. Mirror entity. You got it. I kind of just want to take this rattle chains. Because it's the only thing that can like knock my Liliana off pace. I could also just take this path, and then I can start hitting my opponent on two angles. Because like, if I take the path, eventually my shadow is going to get into play. Okay, so they're just gonna. All right, you got it. It is kind of odd for our, my opponent to like 
to have them watch me bring like have the option to discard a sideboard card from your their deck and then like have them just not me not take it. You know what I mean? Like that's got to mean something, right? Like should this card be in your deck? All right, we're going to do this. Then whatever, I'll just kill the spell color if they decide to do it. Okay. I do have to actually win the game. Have to win the game. I'm just going to terminate this thing right now. And I guess I'll just crack this bobble in my opponent's upkeep. I mean, I guess there's... There's not really a big of a reason. Another spell color. Okay. That's nice. So let's start with this. This should be the bait. Oh, they let that go. Okay, let's get rid of Battle Rage. No, it's Stubborn Denial of this. Playing a little fast now, so we might not do everything super. The fact that they have double spell colors is annoying. Should I let this one go? I probably actually... Because they're going to dismember my Death Shadow next turn. They're going to spell calling my Death Shadow next turn. Did I? We're trying to play quick here. So I'm missing some stuff here. Which is my fault that we're so far down on clock. We need to ult to win. Kill it. Alright, that's not bad. So now we go here. They spell queller it. We dismember the spell queller plus on this, and then we're in good shape. Got it. You got it. Cast. Target them. Path to Exile, plus here, Flare Boy, <laughs> needs more F6, oh, we got F6 now, Moreland Hot, and the Rest in Peace deck. So I'm just going to pick this thing off right now. Oh, that's probably just going to win the game. I mean, like, I don't really know what this thing does. It looks like it pumps creatures and shit. Whatever. Go here. You give that. Sounds good. I attack. I dismember something. And then I battle rage. It's probably enough. I haven't really counted. But... We got it. Like, this was a little fast and loose here towards the end, but I was just looking to get this game over with before we lost. Yeah, we did just mark them. But, yeah, like, the problem was that I played, I probably played the second game poorly, and I probably played this game a little poorly. I just was trying to do it to play fast. Wasn't really thinking, but. But, all right, we're 4-2. Let me stop this here. 